Got a boo-boo? Patch it up with CKI. This week on Sunny TV, we are featuring a lot of different clips, including the Compton Initiative, submitted by Cal State Fullerton. Every few months, the Metro Division, the Foothill Division, and the Magic Kingdom Division get together to do service in Compton to help beautify and make a more positive image for Compton. It's in the final three. Um, I've been doing this for about three years now and personally this is one of my favorite service events not only because it helps me facilitate my social skills with my peers around me but it actually gives me this powerful feeling that I've actually done service and that I actually gave a contribution to towards you know society in general. The Magic Coast DCM was featured by both LTGs, Carrie Tam and Kevin Cruz, to have their members from each division come together to participate in awesome icebreakers. Say hi. Hi. Say hi. 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 Hi, Mark. Yay. So what are you doing right now? I'm writing a letter to my friends. Yay! Yeah. Yay! Yeah. Yeah, Magic Kingdom loves Metro Division! <laughs> yeah. And for meeting their quota of 50 members participating at the DCM, both Lieutenant Governors got pied in the face. Let's check out those clips. Watch out for the backpack! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Your turn! <laughs> Play that in slow mode. And now for some district updates. Woo! At the last board meeting that took place on July 20th, a lot of changes were made to the district awards. For example, copyright infringement is now upheld by the Kiwanians who judge the awards at district convention as well as fall training conference. There have also been changes to the new MRP system. Please stay tuned for an update from Tay Lim, our District Membership Development and Education Chair, for an update on what changes have been made. The District Kiwanis Family Committee would like your school to participate in the College Expo at the District Kita College. The District Kita College will be taking place during the District Summer Service Social during Kiwanis District Convention on August 16th. They are asking members to bring a poster board visual, as well as any materials that you may need to showcase your school. Remember that you don't have to attend Keaton College to turn in a poster board. Please contact Sam Kang, the District Kiwanis Family Chair, or your respective divisional liaison if you are interested in participating in the College Expo. A couple of weeks ago, myself, District Secretary Johnny Pagno, District Treasurer Alan Perez, and Paradise Lieutenant Governor Gerald Biondo all had the opportunity to go put the H back in CNH. The H is none other than our beautiful Hawaii Circle K members. In Hawaii, we did some amazing service, meet with a bunch of Kiwanians, and also meet some key clubbers, as well as participate in numerous fellowship activities with the Hawaii Circle Kers. The district board representatives, as well as the Hawaii Circle K members, went to the Make-A-Wish Foundation in Oahu, where we made countdown chains for children. On day four of the Hawaii experience, we went to meet with Hilo Circle K members, where we did service in the rain. What happened was that the four of us stood out, holding cups that featured different drinks to carry to the runners while they ran in the rigorous rain. If there's one thing I learned from Hawaii Circle K members, it's that Hawaii Circle K members do service, rain or shine. And now for some international updates, Woo! Did you apply for an international committee? If you did, results will be posted on the 28th. Congratulations to all that applied, and good luck to you all. You are truly making a difference in this organization, as well as your own self-development. Congrats to you. Thank you for watching this episode of Sunny TV. Shout out to Cal State Fullerton, UC Irvine, and UN Reno for sending their clips to Sunny TV. If your club wants to get featured in future episodes of Sunny TV, be sure to send in your clips. 
All the information on how to do that is in the description below. And as always, if you like what you see, be sure to like and subscribe for more Sunny TV. Golden Gate Division recently held the Golden Gate Officers Training Conference. Oh. I think loads of service projects is the only way. Closer is